Hello, good evening. Hello, good evening, Mr. Mauricio. Hello, good evening, Miss Sandra. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, how are you? Fine, and you? <laughs> That's good, I'm good. That's great. Hi, good evening. Hi. Hi, good evening, Mr. Mauricio, how are you? Hi, fine, and you? I'm good, thank you for asking. Ready, mm -hmm. ready to start the class. Yes, of course. Get ready? Yes, I'm ready. <laughs> That's good. That's good, good, good. So we are going to wait a few seconds for the other ones that haven't come, okay? Okay. Vamos okay. a esperar unos segundos, okay, for the other ones so we can continue, okay? Hello, Mr. Ezequiel. Welcome. Hi, Miss. Hi. How are you, Mr.? Good evening. I'm okay, teacher. Great. That's good. <clears throat> okay, so let's wait. Hello, Miss Rebecca. Welcome. Hello, teacher. Hello, Good how evening. are you, Miss? I'm, fi I'm fine, thanks. And yes. you? I'm good, thank you for asking. That's good, good, good. Let's wait one more minute, okay? Hello, let's see who else has joined. Hello, Miss Navy. How are you, Miss? Hi, dear. Hi. Frank, thank. Nice, that's good. And you? I'm good, thank you for asking. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Okay, so let's start. Hello, Miss Andrea Amalia. Welcome to. Okay, so let's get started with today's class. So today it is, we are going to continue with English for Work program. As you know, this is basic module number four in my name. One more time is Lisa Rosmen Alvarado Martinez. And today it is Tuesday, October 25th, 2022. And uh, we are going to continue with unit number two, that it is online ordens and refounds, right? And so today we are going to continue with, uh, you're going to ask and give information about products in a polite way. Vamos a hacer un poco de práctica, like conversations again, right? And uh, in this case, today we are going to use can and could, okay, for uh for formal request, okay? And also today we are going to learn can and could for abilities and for possibilities, right? And so, yes, well, this is what we are going to do. Um, I remember that yesterday, some of you didn't finish with the, with the conversations that we were doing, right? So, 
uh, but I, and I know some of you uh, already passed, like I think Mr. Mauricio has already passed with the conversation, right? But we were missing some of you, right? Pero nos faltaban algunos de ustedes that you passed to do the conversation from yesterday. Remember that yesterday was using these, that, those, and this, right? The topic of the demonstrative, right? That we were doing. Um, so who is missing from the from yesterday's conversation? Michelle? You passed yesterday? No, right? No, means. Okay, with who you were working for, for? I mean, with, it would be with who you were working with. Mm. <laughs> you yeah. don't remember? I'm sorry? <laughs> you don't remember? And Kenya, I think. Kenya, <laughs> oh, but Kenya is not here yet. Z. Oh my goodness. And who else besides Kenya? Kenya and Francisco. Oh, they haven't come. No, oh, no han venido ninguno de los dos. Ah, oh, that's sad. What about me, Rebecca? Uh, we work with lady. Okay, Miss Lady, Xiomara. Ah, you were together, yeah. right? You were together. Okay, so who was the customer and who was the, the agent? Uh, we were the question and uh -huh. answer. Okay. Uh, we don't say who is who. Can I see? <laughs> oh my goodness, you only did questions. Yes. Okay. That's okay. Don't worry. Okay. Um, can you do some questions to her, please, Miss? For example, uh -huh. the product is a t-shirt. Uh-huh. Uh, a t-shirt. The question, uh -huh. what color do you have? Uh-huh. The... And, and she, a lady answer, or no? Yes. Okay, Miss Lady, what was the answer, Miss? Um, the answer is the color white, black, and purple. <laughs> <laughs> okay, very good. And, and then, and después? what are the signs? Okay, what are the designs? Uh huh. Polo shirt. Okay. <laughs> the polo what, shirt. What size? It's small. It's small. Okay. Pequeña. <laughs> it's small. Okay. How much that does it cost? Okay. Fifteen dollars. Okay. And how do you deliver? <sighs> Eh, no sé si es la respuesta correcta, pero es by mail, es por correo. By mail, ok. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's perfect, Miss. Very good. <laughs> And that's it, or you have some more? Only that. Oh, Only but that's, okay. that's perfect. <laughs> oh my goodness, because you ask the color, the size, the type of delivery. Perfect. Very good, porque utilizaron todo lo que, pues obviamente les pedí el, el tipo del, del delivery, que el color. That's good. Thank you, girls. And Thank you. Nice, Thank amazing. You. Let's do Abigail. With who you were working for? with? Sorry, Miss. With who do you work for? Uh, within that conversation. Miss? Miss Abigail? Abigail Bonilla, are you there, Miss? I think she's not here. Hello? Hello, do you work in the conversation yesterday? No, I don't know. <laughs> the conversation yesterday? About the demonstrative. Uh huh. Yeah. These, that, those. Do you practice with like that or no? You didn't. 
Mm. Or you don't remember. Or you, okay, if you don't remember, that's okay. Okay, don't worry. We are going to practice right now. Everybody is going to practice right now. In fact, okay, we are going to do a little bit of a dictation, okay? Because I want to see how much do you understand, okay? And you have to write, right? How are you going to do it? So you have to listen to me, listen to the instructor, and you have to write down the sentence, okay? And when I finish dictating you, you have to show me the notebook in the camera, and I will see a little bit. No sé, yo, algunos lo puede ver, algunos no, porque obviamente you're going to be like this, right? Like this, okay? So, and you're going to show me the, no, the sentence, right? Lo que se puedan, porque cuando tienes background, pues no se puede, ¿verdad? But, okay, you are going to show me in, at the end, cuando terminamos la dictation, me la van a enviar a WhatsApp, pero cuando terminemos, okay, ahorita no, okay, so let's go with the first sentence of dictation, okay, write down, okay, escribamos, the number one, number one sentence is, that is my friend, está fácil, it's easy, that is my friend. Number two, ready? Show me, show me. That is my friend. I don't see it in the notebook. Yes, very good, Miss Michelle. Poquito, Miss, pero sí. Yeah, very good, Miss Michelle. Thank you. Very good, Miss Dania. Very Teacher, good. could you repeat that again, please? Number one, mister. Yeah, Miss. That is my friend. That. Okay. That is my friend. Very good, Miss Sandra. Very good, Miss Mr. Mauricio. Very good, Mr. Juan Jose. Yes, very good. Yes, Mr. Very good, Miss Rebecca. Uh, yeah, very good, Mr. Jose Ezequiel. Okay. Mi Hi, Miss Lady. What happened to your cell phone? No, Miss, no se va a poder ver porque está blurry. Don't worry. Después, uh, no se mira blurry. Hasta yo desaparezco. <laughs> si me acerco mucho. <laughs> Okay, number two. <laughs> number two. This is my this is my brother's toy. This is my brother's toy. Okay. Okay, show it to me. Okay, uy, 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 my phone. A very good, Miss Michelle. Very good, Miss Dania. Me, uh, well, ya, ya le voy a corregir algunos. Rebecca, very good. Very good, Mr. Juan José. Very good, Mr. Jorge Antonio. Ezequiel, a little bit up, please. Uh, very good, Mr. José Ezequiel. Very good, Miss Sandra. Uh, Michelle, it's blurry. <laughs> we disappear, Michelle. We disappear. I don't know why. <laughs> Mr. Mauricio, uh, brothers. Okay. My brother's toys. Okay. Okay. Number three. Okay. Number three. These look like the bicycles. These look like the bicycles. This look like the bicycles. Hello, uh, no, 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 Miss Mitchell, no, Mr. Mauricio. These look like the bicycles. No, todos están incorrect, incorrect, no. It's plural. Bicycle. These or this, yeah. It would be T-H-E-S-E, -E. okay, this. Like. This, uh, exactly, Mr. Jorge Antonio. This look like the bicycles. 
Yes, very good, Mr. Jose Ezequiel. Thank you. <coughs> uh, no, Mr. Mauricio. This look yeah, like the bicycles. Uh -huh. This. Ya se la puede mandar igual. Just, I'm going well, I'm gonna show it to you. Ah, exactly, Mr. Mauricio. Very good. Okay. Yeah, bicycles. Yes, very good, Miss. Eh, Abigail, very good, Miss Rebecca. Yeah, bicycles. Okay, let's see number four. Those are my mother's rings. I mean, rings. Those are my mother's rings. Okay, rings. Let's see. Ooh, Mr. Ezequiel. Hmm, you're missing something. Those are my mother's rings. Yes, Miss Rebecca, very good. Hi, Mr. Juan Jose. It disappeared. We disappeared. Yeah, very good. Yes, Mr. Juan Jose, very good. Excellent. Thank you. Yes, Miss Abigail. Thank you. Very good, Mr. Jorge Antonio. Very good, Miss Michelle. Very good. Uh, mothers. Very good, Miss Elizabeth Pineda. Thank you. Yes, very good, Mr. Jose Ezequiel. Mr. Mauricio, mothers. Mothers. Yeah, with apostrophe and S, mothers. Because remember, oh. we are talking about the that the rings are from the mother. So to show possession, okay. yeah. Pertenece. Uh, exactly. Possession. Yes, very good. Possession. Yeah. Very good, Miss Sandra, too. I already see it, Miss Sandra. Sorry that I didn't see, that it didn't say anything. Ya lo había visto, Miss Sandra, solo que no lo había dicho. I'm sorry. Yeah, but you were good. And the last one, number five. Number five, it is, uy, ¿qué dice? Uh, these, these um, are her things. These are her things, okay? These are her things. Think. Things. Think. Yes, things. Ooh, no, things. Very, no, Miss Michelle. No, no, not again. These are her things. Very good, Mr. Jorge Antonio. Thank you. Very good, Miss. Uh, her things. Mm -mm -mm. Very good, Mr. Juan Jose. You're missing a G. Things, cosas. Mr. Jose se queda a little bit, a little bit up. Miss Rebecca, no. These. Very good, Mr. Jose Ezequiel. I'm going to show you the sentences right now. All her things. No, 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 no. You're showing me another thing. Let me show you the sentences. All of the sentences are these. Estas son las oraciones. Please, please correct them because the correct sentence uh, was these are her things. Okay. okay. This yeah. Means yes. Yeah. So check them out. Check them out. And then after, please send a picture to WhatsApp so I can see the uh, correct um answers okay i i want to see want to see what do you have okay Ready? Oh, wait. Send me the picture, please. Okay. 
While you do that, mientras espero por el... Uh, thank you, Mr. Juan José. I'm gonna pass attendance. Voy a pasar asistencia. Please say presente, okay? Uh, let's see, Abigail Mejía. Andrea Amalia. Daniel Lisbeth. Presente, chao. Thank you. Dilce Yamilet. Give me one second, please. Present teacher. Soy Andrea Amalia, pero se me olvidó quitarle el oyente. Ah, oh, no problem. Okay, thank you, Miss, for letting me know. Francisco Ernesto. Present teacher. Thank you, Mr. Welcome, Mr. Thank you. Okay. Jorge Antonio. Present teacher. Thank you. Jose Ezequiel. Present teacher. Thank you. Kenia, ah, no, 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 Juan Jose. Present teacher. Thank you. Kenia Elizabeth. Present teacher. Thank you. Lady Xiomara. Present teacher. Thank you, Miss. Mauricio Antonio. Present teacher. Thank you. Uh, Mirna Elizabeth. Present. Thank you, Miss. Rebecca Guadalupe. Present. Sandra Abigail. Present. Thank you. Sandra Patricia. Present teacher. Thank you. Stephanie Michel. Present. Thank you. Okay, thank you everybody for saying and doing the attendance with me. Okay, let's move on. Do we have any questions so far? Wait a second. Somebody's texting me. No mencioné Esmeralda. Esmeralda, oh no, 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 I'm sorry. Esmeralda del Carmen. Present teacher. Thank you, Miss. I'm sorry, es que me confundí. Me pasé de Dilcia, me pasé de un solo a Mr. Francisco. I'm sorry, Miss Esmeralda. I'm sorry. Okay, so let's go and, and we are going to continue with the next activity, okay? And this next activity that I have for you today, it's called mention a thing with a letter, okay? Este, vamos a tener como una, una wheel, like a spinner wheel. Vamos a tener como una ruleta y vamos a ver este, algunas letras. What do you have to do? Everybody, uh, we have to mention a word with the letter that you see. Van a mencionar una palabra con la letra que ustedes vean ahí en la will, okay? So let's go, la vamos a ir ahí, okay? Todos van a, van a tener un uh, like uh, time, okay? Turn to say them. Wait a second, solo che quiero chequear cuántos me han enviado. Okay, I have seven notification, that's great. Pero vamos a chequear. Okay, so, okay, so let's start. Let's start with Mr. Mauricio. You were going to be the first one, Mr. Okay. Okay, Mr. Can you tell me one word with the letter G? Yeah. God. Oh, very good. Thank you. Let's go. Miss Sandra Patricia, can you tell me a word with the letter T? Tomato. Yes, very good. Thank you. That was easy. <laughs> Thank you. Let's go with Abigail Bonilla. Can you tell me a word with the letter Z? Ooh, that's difficult. Two. Oh, yes, very good. 
Let's see, next one. Miss Rebecca, tell me a word with the letter. Way. V. Miss Rebecca? Vehicle. Oh, mm, one more time. Vehicle. How do you how do you spell that? B. Mm -hmm. B. Uh huh. H. H. Uh huh. I. Vegeta. C. Uh huh. Ah, vehicle. Vehicle. Yes. Uh -huh. Vehicle. Oh, very good, oh. Miss. Or vegetable or vet, right? Very good, Miss. Thank you. Vehicle. Let's go. Next one. Help me, please, Miss Michelle. Let's see. Wait a second, Miss Michelle. I, I am stuck. Okay, there. Let's see. Okay. Okay, Miss Michelle, uh, work with the letter A. Ooh, it's easy, 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 me. Tell me. Apple. Oh, <laughs> that was easy. Very good. Thank you. <laughs> Let's go with the next one. Tell me a word with the letter J, Miss Andrea. Hi, teacher. Hi. Me poncho. Yes, Miss. Think about it. No, think, Miss. Usted puede, Miss. Pensemos, pensemos. Una letra, una palabra con la letra J. Think, think, think. We have time. Mm. Mm -hmm. Use. Oh, very good. You see? Use. Excellent. Use. Excellent. Thank you, Miss. Let's go, okay. Miss Dania. Yeah. Dania. <coughs> Letter H. Daniel. How? I'm sorry, one more time. How? House. Yes. Oh, very good. Thank you, Miss. Let's go next one. Miss Lady. One word with the letter F. Tell me. Family. Yes, we're good, Miss Lady. Amazing. Let's go next one. Can you tell me a word with the letter X, Miss Kenya? Saxophone. Oh, saxophone is with S, Miss. With S, pero esta es con X. Tiene que empezar con X. Sanadu. ¿Ah? Sanadu. Sanadu. What is that, mister? Can, can you spell it for me, it, please? Uh, X. Ajá. Uh -huh. A. Ajá. Uh -huh. M. Ajá. Uh -huh. I. A. I. A. D. U. It's movie. You, you like this? Sanadu. Like that, mister? Like I read it there? It's, a, it's, it's like that? It's a, it's, a, it's a movie. Really? Sanadu. Yeah, I was going to say, so like saxophone, I was going to say that it's like the, oh my goodness, how do we say it here? So like saxophone. Marimba. In, 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 in English, it's a like saxophone. And in, in Spanish, it's marimba. So like saxophone. Marimba. Okay. Yeah, uh huh. So I like the phone. So I, like, I, don't, I just don't remember how to raise a light phone right now. Wait, let me see. Give me one second. So I like phone, I guess. Wait. wait a second. So let me, because I don't remember really. No, it doesn't appear like that. Oh my goodness, I forgot. It's O, teacher. Ah? It's, it's a letter O. O, and then? Yes. And then, what is the other one? 
Oh, it's, it's like uh, yeah. this. It's a light phone, exactly. This is a word. It's similar Teacher, to... X yeah. ray to rayos X. Ah, yes, X-ray, very good. X-ray, excellent, Miss. Thank you. Okay, right yeah, it's a, that's another one. Very good, thank you. Let's go next one. Can you help me with the next one, please, Miss Elizabeth Pineda? Okay, Miss Elizabeth, tell me a word with the letter R, please. Rose. Oh, very good, Miss. Thank you. Let's go. Next one, Miss. Mm -mm -mm. Mr. Francisco, tell me a word with the letter K. Keep. Yes, very good. That was easy, right? Let's see next one. Mr. Jorge Antonio, tell me a word with the letter O. Orange. Oh, very good. Let's see next one. It would be uh, 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 Mr. Juan Jose, a word with the letter W. Wait. Yes, very good. Let's see next one. Mr. Jose Ezequiel, a word with the letter. S. Soap. I'm sorry, one more time. Soap. Soup or yes. soap. No, es soup, es cierto. Soup, like sí. the one, or soap, like, para lavarnos las manos, which one? No, de jabón. Okay, soap, es soap, y soup, okay. Like okay. Ajá, uh -huh, that would be very good, thank you. And I think everybody has participated, thank you very much. That was, that was a little bit of practice for vocabulary, okay? Remember that is very important, okay? Uh, so we can develop more vocabulary for you, okay? Question so far, preguntas de momento? In, uh, um, I don't know, questions, questions? Or no questions. Please, just a reminder, un recordatorio. Please, please work in the, work in the platform, okay? In la plataforma eh, after the class. Remember, it's important. For this week, we have section two and midterm. Remember, recuerden que para esta semana tenemos la sección número dos y tenemos el midterm. So please work, work, okay? Let's go and continue. And for today's class, as I told you, we are going to have a little bit of uh, can and could. But before that, before we continue, we are going to name some abilities that a person can have, okay? Like, for example, I can drive a car. What abilities do you have? Can you mention to me some abilities, please, that you have? Can you mention to me? I uh -huh. can't play the guitar. Ah, really? That's cool, Miss. That's amazing. <laughs> nice. For real, Miss? De verdad, mea. Ah, okay. For real. And, uh, <laughs> for real. And I was like, mm, is it just a sentence? I pensé que solo una oración, pero no. I want you to be real. <laughs> okay, let's see. Another, yes. another one? Another ability that you have? I can, and then you say the ability, please. Mm -hmm. Another ability? Any other abilities? Nobody else? I, I can. can't think. <gasps> Oh, really? That's great. We are going to have a singing contest there. Ah, no, just kidding. <laughs> okay, very good. Mr. Mauricio, tell me. I can play soccer ball. Oh, nice. Very good. I have two lefties. I cannot play. I cannot play soccer. Me raspo toda. <laughs> if I play soccer, yeah, for real, I cannot. Anything else? What about the other ones? Mm -hmm. uh -huh. 
what happened to the other ones? Tell me your abilities. I can swim. Mm. You can swim in the beach or in the pool, miss? The pool. In the pool, okay. No, porque hay diferencia. Let me tell you. In the beach, con las olas, is very, very hard. In the pool, it's like easy. A little bit easy. <laughs> porque si es onda, ¿verdad? no. <laughs> it's not that easy. <laughs> yeah. Another one? Another ability, Mr. Jorge, Mr. Juan Jose. Maybe whistle? <laughs> I, I can play basketball. Oh, great. Nice. Uh huh. Another ability. Remember abilities. Oh, just a reminder. What is an ability? ¿Qué es una habilidad? Una, un recordatorio. Una habilidad es algo que aprendiste. Ok, aprendiste ya sea de que estaba chiquito o lo aprendiste hace poco. Y un talento, un talent, it's something that you have it like since you were born. Ok, y un talento, un talent, es algo que tú tienes desde que naciste y nunca se te olvida. Ok. Um, so that's a bit, yeah, Mister. What about the skills? Skills is similar to talent as well. Es similar a talento, okay? Because no todas las personas somos skillful, okay? Vamos a escribir esas palabritas que acabamos de mencionar. By the way, in the whiteboard. Give me one second. And so we have a talent and a skills, okay? Desde que we are born, okay? Desde que nacemos, tenemos una habilidad, un talento, okay? And then we have abilities, okay? Abilities, we learn them, okay? Las aprendemos, okay? We learn them and we learn them like, and we have to practice. Y las habilidades hay que practicarlas porque si no, se nos olvidan. For example, speaking in English is, is an ability because if you don't practice, you forget, okay? So it's an ability to speak another language. So you're very, you have a lot of abilities now because you speak in English. Any other ones? Any other abilities? Think about the abilities that you have. Piensen, todos tenemos diferentes habilidades, right? Teacher. Yes. I, I can ping pong. Play ping pong. Ah, yes, definitely. Play ping pong. O podemos decir table tennis, Miss, ¿ok? Table okay. tennis, it would be uh, the, the, in English, ¿ok? En español sería el ping pong, ¿ok, Miss? O también le decimos en okay. inglés, en español, eh, juego de, de, creo que es, ¿cómo que se dice? Oh, my goodness, yo ya lo he escuchado, que le, no le dicen ping pong. Juego español. de mesa. No, no es juego de mesa, es... Tenis. tenis, tenis de mesa, exactly, thank you. Tenis de mesa, it will be in uh, Spanish. Ah, ride a bicycle, that's another one, okay. No todos ponemos, podemos ride a bike, okay. Because, for example, for me, I learned like many years ago, but I cannot anymore. I can't ride a bike. Yo, por ejemplo, yo aprendí a andar en bicicleta. No estaba chiquita, pero yo ya no me acuerdo. O sea, es una habilidad, ¿ok? Porque se olvida. O sea, we have to practice, practice, practice. The abilities you have to practice. So you can remember. Right? Remember that. Another ability that you have. Oh, play the guitar. Me dijeron ya. It's sing. I can cook. Ah, exactly. That's another ability. Basketball. Play soccer. Um, eh, oh my goodness, cook. Uh -huh. A eh, cook. What else? A eh, swim. Swim in the pool, right? Oh, sorry. Another thing that you can do. <laughs> tell me, tell me. Abilities. Dance. Ah, exactly, right? It's not the same to dance reggaeton as dance salsa, mm -hmm. right? Right? We have to learn to dance salsa because it's, it's different, right? If you can have dance salsa or merengue or what else? Salsa, merengue, and bachata, right? That's an ability. 
Definitely. Esa es una habilidad, de hecho. En other, en other, contemporáneo, right? Classical music. There are many things. Very good. Okay, now, ooh. So, wait a second. There are many abilities that we have in our daily life, right? Hay muchas habilidades que tenemos en nuestra vida diaria, as you mentioned right now. But there are some abilities that you have in your jobs or in your workplace, okay? Just give me one second so I can show you the manual and we can read the conversation that we have over there. Just give me a second, please. Where is it? Oh, here. Okay, so here we have the manual, okay? This is in page 21 if you want to go there, okay? And here we have the first activity and the activity says, um, so the first one in the, like the first question is, what products do you sell at your workplace? Like what things do you sell in your workplace? Or if you sell something, <laughs> Uh, what do you sell? Yo sé que algunos pues no venden tal vez, but uh, what things do you sell? For the rest, los que tengan venta ahí en sus workplace, en sus lugares de trabajo, what do you sell? Or nothing, or nobody sells here, or nadie tiene venta aquí, or works. Mm -hmm. How do you say pintor? Paint. Paint. Uh -huh. yeah. Lija. And, ooh, Lija, way. I don't remember how to say Lija. No. Lija, I remember. Ah, sandpaper. Last, yo me acuerdo que lo habíamos dicho, sandpaper. Sandpaper. Uy. Ajá. Uh -huh. Anything else for the other ones? What do you sell? For the rest? Or you don't sell, or los demás no venden my, nada. Apps, yes, Mr. Juan Jose. In my workplace, sells IT services. IT services, oh, okay, that's great. I was going to ask that. Everybody, if you don't say something, you sell services, okay? Igual, aunque no vendan un objeto, tal vez venden, eh, like for example, Miss Michelle, she sells services of, law, right? Like documents, right? Porque trabaja en una law firm, en una, um, what is the name in Spanish? Una firma de abogados. Right, miss? Yes. Uh -huh. So it will be in a law firm. She sells like documents, like maybe with the uh, seals and things like that. Uh -huh, very good. And all the things, Miss Michelle? Um. Asesoría, no sé. Ah, you, wait, it would be like, mm, 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 help clients, help, okay. help the clients uh -huh, very, with the problems, very good, that would be like another one, you help. And documentos certificados? Certified documents. Okay. Ah, definitely, certified documents, right? Very good. Uh huh. What about the other ones? Uh, oh, Miss Michelle. Yeah. Are the other things that you do? Think about it. What are the things do you sell? Medicament, medicaments. Mm -mm, medicine. In medicine. Uh huh. Medicine. Definitely very good. Medicine. Mm -hmm. What about the other ones? <laughs> what else? Helps, services, service. Mm -hmm. Help with, help with documents. Okay. And many more things like maybe books, right? Just tal vez en eh, Miss Elizabeth, digamos que vendan, Libros, right, Miss, in the school. <laughs> I don't know what else. Uh, paper, maybe. <laughs> okay. Ink, maybe. Okay. Okay. Many things you can sell at your workplace, right? Now, 
As you can see here, we have a little bit of a conversation. Tenemos una conversación por acá. We have two people, Linda and Juan. Can you help me please to read this conversation? Hmm, volunteers to help me read, please, volunteers. Mi teacher. Okay, thank you, Mr. Mauricio, and? Me. Thank you, Mr. Jose Ezequiel. Okay, Mr. Mauricio, okay. you may, may start, please, thank you. Uh, thank you so much for calling. Linda is speaking. How can I help you? Mm -hmm. Hi, Linda. <clears throat> Could you? Could you give me some information about the pro washer? Mm -hmm. Of course. It has a capacity of the 5.2. Good. Good. Keyboard. Right. It could fit. F T. I get fit. Uh -huh. Q no, fit. Fit. Uh -huh. fit. Fit. A turbo processor mm -hmm. and intelligent capable. I see. Can you give me information about the warranty? I'm sorry. Would you repeat that, please? Can you give me information about the warranty? Thank you. The guarantee of, of it is for... Okay. Thank you, Mr. Okay, as you can see, in this case, they are uh, asking for inf for information of an object, right? Están pidiendo información acerca de eh, un producto. And what words did they use? ¿Qué palabras usan para o utilizan para pedir la información? Can, right? For help. Mm -hmm. They also use could, right? To ask for the information. Can. And because I, as I told you before, those are some words that you can ask or for, re, or for requests or you can do requests, right? And then I have some questions for you. What does one want to buy according to the conversation? What is the object that he wants to buy? Processor. A processor, really? Hmm. Mm. Hmm. Let's go back to the. What does he want to buy? ¿Qué es lo que quiere comprar de acuerdo con la conversación? About. A washer. A washer. A pro washer. Okay. Very good. So he remembered that we have to do it in a formal way. He wants to buy a pro washer. Number two, what question can you say instead of repeat? Warranty for warranty. Hmm. No, it says, what question can you say instead of repeat? What question can you say instead of repeat? ¿Qué preguntas puedes hacer en vez de eh, repeat? Say that again. Say that again, but in this conversation? Could you repeat? Aha. Uh, uh -huh. Could you repeat? Repeat. Uh -huh. Could that, you repeat please. exactly? Could you repeat that, please? Even though it says repeat, could you repeat that, please? And are the customer and the agent polite or impolite? Polite. Please, polite. Why? How do you know? Why? Why they are polite? Because it was polite. <laughs> but how do you know if he was, if she was polite, sorry. Pero como sabes? How do you know that? Like, why? Because, because he, he said cool and can. Okay. 
Anything else? She uses could and can. Okay. What else? She also uses I'm sorry phrases, right? Utiliza frases como, por ejemplo, I'm sorry, could, and also things, okay? Uh, like polite words, okay? Porque también eh, utiliza palabras que son muy or very, very polite, okay? And uh, now let's go and wait, we already did this one. And so basically, today we are going to practice can and could for polite, for request, and for possibility. Okay, vamos a practicar. Yo sé que anteriormente en nivel en módulo number two, you practice can and could for possibilities and for requests, I guess. But today we are going to practice in three forms. Vamos a practicarlos ahora eh, en tres eh, maneras. Para habilidades, para requests, o sea, para solicitudes eh, y para possibilities y para posibilidades. So please pay attention, okay? First, we are going to go with abilities, que le era lo que estábamos preguntando al inicio, vea, vamos a ir con las habilidades. So basically, when you're talking about the present, when we're talking about the present, so we use can and can't. And then you use an action. Y después utilizamos una acción o lo que sabemos hacer, vea. Like, for example, I can cook. She can ride a horse. Can we run for an hour? Okay, that's an ability, right? Not everybody can run for an hour. Or maybe you can say another ability that you mentioned. It could be, wait. Uh, they can play soccer, for example. They, uh, or maybe he can swim, okay? So as you can see here, para la habilidad, pues vamos a utilizar primero el sujeto, and then we are going to use a can, then we are going to use a verb, y después un verbo, vea. Eh, si se fijan, pues no cambia el uh, verbo, ¿verdad? Questions so far? Preguntas al momento? No. Okay. Then we have, después tenemos uh, for mention an ability in the past. Para mencionar una habilidad en el pasado. What happens? We use could or couldn't, okay? Um, here we have, for example, could, at uh, first, I could cook very well. ¿Y qué sucede? Lo único que cambia es el could eh, en vez de can. Y después tenemos la habilidad, vea. Um, like, for example, I could cook, right? The, like cooking, right? And then she could ride a horse. Could you run for an hour? Maybe they could play soccer. Okay, they, um, she, he could swim, okay, in the past, right? For abilities in the past, he could swim or they could uh, uh, play soccer, okay? Questions so far? Okay. Give me one second because I want to go to the whiteboard. Oh my goodness, I cannot see it. Okay, here. Give me a second. Like, for example, uh, in the present, for example, I can say that I can't drive a car, right? Because that is an ability. Not all the people has the ability of the skill to drive a car, right? In the past, for example, for me, I could ride a bike, okay, in the past. So those are my two abilities, okay? Oh, and what happens to the negatives? ¿Y qué sucede con las negativas? So basically for can, it will be can't, right? For example, she can't 
draw. Ok, ella no puede dibujar. In the past it would be she. What would be in the past, everybody? Can you help me, please? She could. She couldn't. Exactly. She couldn't. Draw. Draw. Uh -huh. Draw. Very good. And that will be in the past. Okay. What I want you to do right now, we are going to have a quick activity. I want you to send me two sentences. One ability that you have right now, una habilidad que tengan ahorita mismo y una habilidad que tenían en el pasado, when you were little, ok? Cuando estaban chiquitos, vamos a pensar en nuestras habilidades que teníamos, porque todos teníamos, like, dance, maybe you were, you swim, you ride a bike, you paint, you draw, and but how are you going to do it? You're going to do it in your notebook or in a text and send that in the group one more time, okay? Y lo van a enviar en el grupo, okay? So I'm gonna give you for this, hmm, four minutes, okay? Four minutes, even though it's only two, aunque solo son, solo, solo son dos. Ah, my goodness, se me traba la lengua. Se me lengua la traba. Um, so let's try it, please. Remember to send that in the WhatsApp group, please. Only two origin. Yeah, one, uh, yes, with can or can't, and one we could or couldn't, okay? Thank you, Mr. Mauricio. It would be... You can ride a motorcycle? Ride. Yeah. Ride, okay. So, sería ride like this, Mr. Montana. Right. Ride, okay. no. It's que drive, it's cuando you have like a manubrio. Uh, yeah. Uh -huh, yeah. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Ah, yeah. Uh-huh, yeah. Yeah, ride. Right. Right. Yeah. Okay. I ah. Okay. Okay. Please, Mister. Thank you. Okay. Very good, Miss Elizabeth Pineda. Really. Nice, Mister Juan Jose. That's cool. Teach music. Are you a, a music teacher? Yes, the Saturdays. Great. I teach in my church. Oh, that's great. That's nice. You feel like a teacher then? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> that's good, mister. Nice, nice. What is happening? Okay, very good, Miss Dania. Very good, Miss Rebecca. Very good, Mr. Jorge, Jorge, Mr. Jorge Antonio, yes. Very good, Miss Good For three hours, Miss Lady. Are you a runner? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, can you hear me? 
¿Me escuchan? Ya. Yeah. Ah, yes. okay. yes. Me yes. salió un, un anuncio ahí que tenía problemas con el audio. But wait. Wait a second. Mm -hmm. Oh no, Miss Michelle. Oh my God. For the jocotes, Miss, you climb the tree because for me, yes, I did that too, Miss. I climbed the, the jocotes tree. <laughs> that was good back in the days. Back in the days, not more, not anymore. Let's see, Mr. Francisco. Really? You can, Mr. Francisco? Very good, Miss Esmeralda, too. Wow, that's cool, Mr. Play the bass. Que no sé qué es Jorge. Who is? Wait, ¿quién es? J. Ah, Mr. José Ezequiel. Ajá. I can play the bass. Okay, el bajo. Right? Yes. Wow, Miss Sandra Ramos, very good. Very good, Miss Abigail. And Miss Abigail Mejia, very good. Thank you. Okay. Wait a second. I don't know what is happening. Wait, wait a second. Hello, can you hear me? Solo póngame si yes. yes. ¿Por qué sale eso? Wait. Un segundo. Bueno. Okay, so now that was for abilities. Remember that, okay? Eso que estábamos viendo ahorita pues eran para habilidades. But now we are going to continue with the use for could and can or could or could not or can't okay for a uh, possibilities okay so could not and as you can see here we use could not or can't when we do not uh, have the opportunity or possibility to do something in the past or in the future okay uh could couldn't it's like uh something I couldn't do it like right now and well it can for a possibility permission and request as you can see over there el can pues ya es para habilidades possibilities permission and request igual que el could lastima que en la, I didn't notice that one but yeah it's for the same okay es lo mismo para pedir posibilidad para una posibilidad o sea utilizamos en la pregunta para permission and for request más que todo el can y el could van a ser utilizados en preguntas and for the possibilities for the permission and request. Remember is for questions, okay? Remember always that el can y el could. Ya cuando queramos expresar una habilidad en el presente y en el pasado, pues las utilizamos en oraciones, right? Okay. Now, like for example, here we have an example. When I was young, I couldn't swim. Okay, cuando estaba joven, yo no podía, o más chiquito, yo no podía nadar, right? And then now I can swim, okay? And what you were saying, when he was one year old, he could not read, or maybe now he can read, okay? Those are for abilities. But then, pero ahora vamos con could and can for requests. Give me one second. Vamos para el could y el can for requests. And what happens? ¿Y qué sucede? For a request, we do it like this. Las hacemos así. For a request, what else do we use that for? What is the other option? Uh -huh. Request. More? Permission. Yeah. Permission and possibility, exactly, thank you. So, recuerden, el could y el can, we are going to use it for 
request, permission, and possibility. Para ver si hay posibilidades de algo, ¿verdad? Like, but in questions, right? And preguntas, una vez más, right? Like, and how do you create this type of questions? ¿Cómo creamos este tipo de preguntas? Like, basically, we use first could or can. Primero utilizamos el could y el can. Ajá, primero vamos a utilizar el can. Okay. Ajá. Can and then you use a subject y después utilizamos un sujeto. ¿verdad? Like for example, can you hmm, a request? Can you do the platform? <laughs> We're going to work with that, okay? Can you do the platform? Oh, and how are you going to answer? You can answer yes. Yes, I can. Okay. Ah, okay. You can answer like this. Yes, I can. Or no, I can't, right? Pero también, como en este caso, eh, básicamente siempre se utiliza esto de yes, I can and no, I can't for abilities. Okay, ya cuando estamos hablando mm -hmm. de request, permission, and possibilities, podemos utilizar otras frases, okay? Like, yes, sure. Se fijaron que la conversación decía, yes, of course, okay? Mm -hmm. Eh, you can use other phrases. Pueden utilizar otras frases. ¿Por qué? Porque están pidiendo permiso, solicitándoles algo o una posibilidad de algo. ¿Ok? Maybe we can say also, uh, sure, only sure, or maybe yes, of course. ¿Ok? No, no problem. Uh, ah, no problem. Exactly. Or maybe in a negative way, in una forma negativa, we can answer, I'm afraid. I'm afraid, I'm sorry. I can't, maybe, okay. Para negarse pueden decir, mm -hmm. I, I'm afraid I can't, or I can do it, okay. I'm sorry, okay, I'm sorry. En este caso, pues, como les digo, ¿verdad? vamos a utilizar otras frases ya, okay. For request, permission, and possibility. Like for example, digamos que yo le diga a Mr. Uh, let's see, uh, Francisco, can you borrow me $100? <laughs> a lot of money. <laughs> can you borrow me $100? Huh? I can't. Oh my goodness, Mr. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's see, Tania. That's okay, Mister. Don't, don't worry. Tania, okay. Tania, can you? Let's see. Can you borrow me your phone? Your phone, please. Can you borrow me your phone? No, I can't. Ah, okay. Very good. Thank you, Miss. Recuerden que podemos utilizar las demás, vean. Esas que les puse por acá son opciones este, válidas, ¿ok? Porque recuerden que son eh, requests, solicitudes, permission, permisos y possibilities y posibilidades para realizar algo. Ahora bien, en el caso de el could, igual podemos utilizar esas mismas respuestas. ¿Cuál es la diferencia? Que el can es un poco menos formal y el cool es muy formal, ¿verdad? Like for example, we can say could you hmm, could you uh, what request can we do? Huh? ¿Qué, re ¿Qué request podemos pedir? Could you digamos que andan en el super could you bring me the, uh, could you bring me some milk? Some milk for the cereals. Could you bring me some milk for the cereals, Miss Elizabeth Pineda? Yes, of course. Oh, great. Okay. <laughs> Let's see, Mr. Jorge Antonio. Could you borrow me your notebook, Mr. Your notebook to the, for the notes? Will you borrow me? Yes, of course. Oh, thank you very much, Mr. Let's see, Mr. Jose Ezequiel. Can you, could you give me some copy, Mr.? Of course. 
Wow, that's amazing. <laughs> what about you, Miss Lady? Could you could you dance bachata? Sure. Yes, of course. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. Okay, so like that, okay? Así es para posibilidad, permission, and uh, request. Okay, cualquiera de los dos podemos utilizar. Questions so far? Preguntas al momento? Y aquí tenemos... Yes. Uh -huh. Michelle. So, can no. es más informal y co es más formal, ¿verdad? Exactly. Exactly. No, you're good. Este es formal, okay? Could es formal. With the people that you don't know, con las personas que no conocemos, vea, vamos a utilizar el cool. Y con las personas, with our best friends, our family, can, ok? Thanks. Informa, no problem. Any other question? Tengo una pregunta. Tell es, me, mister. Eh, según lo anterior, habíamos hablado que could uh -huh. era el pasado. Yeah. Y en la oración dice, could you bring some mail? Uh -huh. O sea, ¿podrías? Me estamos, a hablar, estamos hablando en presente. ¿va? Ah, ok. Pero, before, what was the topic before? Pero les dije que les iba a explicar. Bueno, ahorita son cuatro formas, ¿se acuerda? Sí. Les dije, para hablar de habilidades, para hablar de permisos, para hablar de solicitudes y para hablar de posibilidades. Lo, el, al principio les hablé de habilidades en el presente y en el pasado. Yeah. Y por eso me hicieron oraciones. Ahorita les estoy explicando cómo hacer requests, permissions, and possibilities para hacer eh, o para solicitar cosas, ¿ok? Y si se fija, mister, solo lo estamos utilizando como preguntas, no oraciones, ¿ok? No, oh, ok. Ajá, oh, okay. That, that would be the difference, eso sería la diferencia. ¿Qué sucede con este tipo de preguntas? Miren, que las respuestas van a ser así como, yes, of course, no vamos a decir yes, yes, I can, porque esto era para habilidades. Ajá. Y si no, que vamos a utilizar este tipo de preguntas, las que están en rojo ahorita, ¿ok? Yes, sure, sure. Yes, of course. No problem. Y para negarnos, vamos a decir, I'm afraid I can't. I'm sorry. Eso, ese tipo de respuestas también las habían repasado en módulo 2. And, and there are more. Y hay más. Ya les voy a enviar otras por acá. Give me one second. So you can uh, have more ideas para que tengan más ideas. Ok. Wait. Any other question? Porque esto del can y el kun se utiliza para muchas cosas, ¿ok? Pero como les dije, al principio era para abilities, ya hablamos de las abilities. Ahora ya estamos con requests, con solicitudes para solicitar permiso. ¿va? Digamos que ustedes son un adolescente y le quieren pedir permiso al papá para ir a la fiesta. Entonces, ¿cómo le van a decir? Can I, can I go to the want party? To no, pero quiero ir a la fiesta. Yo quiero ir a la fiesta. Mis. Can I go to the party, mom? Me dice. Que okay, es una solicitud. Está pidiendo permiso, vean. Or maybe you can say. Maybe, for example, you're asking permission to your boss. Le quieren pedir permiso al jefe para irse temprano. Huh. How do you say? Could, could you give me permission? Ah, could you give me permission? Please. To leave early? Early? Okay. Ajá, please. Ah, eso es otro. Miren que se utiliza el please con el cool. Ok. That's another one. Uh -huh. Any other question? ¿Alguna otra pregunta o duda? Uh -huh. ¿Y cómo sería acá? Para, could you give, digamos que vamos a ver. Miss Lady, Miss Lady va a ser mi boss. Yo le voy a pedir permiso ahorita. Okay. Miss Lady, 
Miss Lady, could you give me permission to believe early, please? Yes, no problem. Oh, thank you, boss. You are so good, boss. Thank you. Very good, boss. Yeah, that's an amazing boss. <laughs> okay. So that, that that would be all, okay? <laughs> or maybe, o digamos que Miss Rebecca. Miss Rebecca, could you... Digamos que Miss Rebecca is my mother, okay? Miss Rebecca, could you give me twenty dollars, please? <laughs> we don't have any money. Because... I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> Very good. Thank you, Miss. Miss Sandra. Aunque una mamá les pregunta para qué crees este dinero. Ah, es true. verdad. For what do you need the money? <laughs> yes, it's true. Miss eh, Sandra. Miss Sandra, could you, could you send me a picture of your notebook? Could you send me a picture of your notebook, Miss Sandra? Yes, of course. Ah, oh, amazing. Okay. So, very good. Questions. Ahora, dudas? Preguntas? Recuerden. Al principio, ok, eh, y, y le voy a mostrar otra vez las imágenes, ¿verdad? hasta acá era de eh, las habilidades, ¿verdad? Y de, es que tenía muchos ejemplos, por eso, ok, aquí estaba, miren, para ask for a request, y para pedir un, un favor, o para pedir una solicitud, o por algo, dice acá, miren cuál es el orden, el can, el sujeto, el yeah. verbo y algo más para complementar. ¿Ok, mister? Entonces, son temas, o sea, sí, yo sé que es la misma palabrita, pero se puede utilizar para muchísimas cosas. Eh, it, like, it's possible. Y aquí tenemos la otra forma para, para request or for possibility. Could you? ¿Ok? Y creo que tengo más ejemplos. Oh, aquí, miren, tenemos este ejemplo. Can you help me to read, Mr. Mauricio, please, this question? Can you pass me this up? Okay. Oh, miren la respuesta. Can you help me to read, Mister? Mm -hmm. Yes, of course. Y? Sure. Oh, sure. sure. Cualquiera de las dos pueden utilizar, ¿verdad? Como les daba las opciones, ¿verdad? Let's go next one. Can you help me this with this question, please, Miss Abigail Mejia? Yes. yes. Can, you, can you help me to read, please, Miss Mejia? Me ayudas a leer, please? No problem. Okay, thank you. Ajá. Ah, ya me contestó la, la request. Can you help me to read? Yes, of course, me dijo. No, me si me ayuda a leer por acá, por favor. Okay, sorry, teacher. No, that's okay. Yes, it was a request, de hecho. Hey. And you show me your ID card. ID, ID card. ID, ID card. card. Ajá, o como el DUI, ¿verdad? ID card. Y puede ser la respuesta. Ajá. Uh -huh. You are or uh -huh. sure. Or sure. Or sure. Uh -huh. Cualquiera de esas podemos utilizar, ¿verdad? Let's see. Next one. Help me to read, please, Miss. Miss Kenya, please. Miss Kenya? Uh -huh. Oh, you change the channel. Ah, and the answer? Certainly. Certainly. Okay, esa, esas palabras certainly creo que es nueva para ustedes. O, o algunos ya las conocen. Eh, certainly es claro. Okay, o like maybe it could be, it could be like... Um, I don't know, ciertamente es traducido literalmente, pero wait, another one, it could be like, claro, sí. Seguramente. Ah, seguramente, thank you, Miss Elizabeth Pineda. Yes, seguramente, sí lo puedo cambiar, no, no te preocupes, sure, okay, or certainly, that could be the answers. Okay. Mm -hmm. Another one, can you help me to read this question, please, Miss Michelle? Can you show me the way to the post office? Uh, the answers? 
Certainly. Uh -huh. <laughs> sure. Oh, exactly. Very good. Let's see. Next one. Help me to read this question, please. Um, Miss Abigail Bonilla. Could you help me with this report? Uh -huh. Yes, I could be happy to. Yes, sí, estaría feliz de hacerlo, okay? I will be happy to, okay? Let's see another one. Okay, now as you can see here, it says create your own questions. Ahora sí, vamos a crear nuestras propias preguntas. What are you going to do? You're going to create one and one for your classmates, okay? Like, can you or could you? Because remember, when we do a request, cuando hacemos una request, básicamente se lo pedimos a alguien en específico, okay? But right now, it would be for one of your classmates, okay? Choose somebody, van a elegir a alguien, and you're going to do a request. What one with can and one with could, okay? So let's practice, please. Don't send it in WhatsApp. No la vayan a enviar en WhatsApp. Just write it down, prepare them, preparenla. And if you are ready, let me know. Say, I am finished, miss, okay? Si están listos, me avisan, okay? So I can, uh, we can do the questions, okay? ¿Cuántas preguntas, teacher? One and one. One with can and one with could, okay? Thanks. No problem. Questions? No sé si tenemos alguna duda o pregunta al momento, you guys. Let me know, me avisa. Ready. Ready, okay, great, thank you. Listo. Okay, great. Thank you, Miss Michelle. I'm going to give you two. Okay, great. I'm going to give you one more minute, okay, to the rest of the class. Ready, teacher. Okay, great. Okay, let's see. We are going to do the questions. Remember that we have to choose one of your classmates. Give me one second. Okay, uh, so let's see, okay? Uh, so I'm gonna start the way I empezar. I'm gonna do one, well, one question with could and one question with can to one of you. And then that person is going to continue with the little, the little chain, okay? And so let's see, um, Mr. Jose Ezequiel, you're going to be my classmate right now. Can you, can you borrow me your pen? <laughs> Sure. Oh, okay. And could you tell me what's the topic for tomorrow? I don't know, teacher. <laughs> no, just like create. <laughs> just something, but that's okay, Mister. <laughs> Mister, do the questions to like, who is your your choose your chosen one? A quién vas a elegir, Mister? Yo. Yes, tienes que elegir a alguien. Okay. Do I have to ask? Yeah. Or... Yeah, you have to do the questions and write the answers that they do to you. Okay. Uh, let me choose okay. Michelle Oviedo. Okay, great. Okay, listen, Miss Michelle. One, two, three, go. One, two, three, go. <laughs> okay. Tengo que preguntarle. Yes, yes. Okay. Um, lo que sea. Do you see, do you create the questions with can and could, mister? Do you, 
Do you create the questions with can and could? Si creaste las preguntas con el can y con el could? Yes. Okay, so you I have did. to do the questions to Miss Michelle. Okay. And write the answers. Okay. Okay, mm -hmm. one, two, three, go. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, can I go to the concert? <laughs> <laughs> yes, of course. Okay. okay. And the other one is could you give me some sugar? Oh. Yes, no problem. Oh, okay. very good. Okay, so like that, okay, we are going to work in pairs, okay? I'm going to put you in teams. Lo voy a poner en teams mejor, eh, like little groups. So in breakout rooms, okay? Para que puedan hacer las preguntas, okay? Porque si nos ponemos así, we are not going to finish anymore, like right now, okay? And I want you to write the answers. Y, hagan las, eh, y quiero que escriban las respuestas que le den sus compañeros, okay? Questions. Tenemos preguntas, dudas. Questions, no. questions? No questions, okay. So if you can, okay? Si puede, y si terminan antes, porque yo he visto a varios y eso era algo que ya días tengo en mente y que les quería decir. Yo ya he, he ingresado a algunos breakout rooms, ok? Y you finish, you are fast. Ustedes son súper rápidos, yo ya lo veo que, okay, like, very fast. Cuando terminemos, yo les voy a pedir de favor que intentemos crear más preguntas, que intentemos practicar más allá, ¿ok? Porque yo sé que algunos, algunos compañeros a veces se cuestan unir a, a los grupos, algo otros compañeros tienen problemas de conexión, entonces les tengo que dar un poquito más de tiempo. ¿eh? Yo les digo siempre, I'm sorry, can you give me one more minute? Les digo a los que han terminado. ¿eh? Cuando usted termine, continue. Porque recuerden que... Practice makes perfect. Si usted practica más, it would be so much better. Va a ser muchísimo mejor. Entonces vamos a intentar crear más preguntas de las que hemos creado. ¿Ok? Yes. Yes. Are we good? Si ¿Sí vamos a estar de acuerdo yes. en eso. Ok. Yes. Great. Great. Ok. okay. Uh, so let's go. For this, I'm going to give you only five minutes again. Ok. Hopefully we don't have any like eh, contratiempos. Ok. So wait a second. Okay, so I'm gonna put you in groups of three and two. And for these five minutes, okay? Wait, okay, let's go. Practice, practice, okay, everybody? And write the answers, right? Write the answers of the questions that you create. Accept the invitation and thank you, let's work. entre nosotras y copiar las respuestas. Ok. Ya que somos tres, <ríe> nos repartimos una pregunta cada uno. Ajá. <ríe> no, all of the questions so you can write and practice more. Practice, practice, please. Yes, of course. Okay. La otra. Could you lend me $25, please? Yes, yeah, sure. Just I hope you uh, back to me the next week. <laughs> Call you? <laughs> Call you? With no, interest no? or with, without interest? <laughs> without uh, interest. <laughs> ¿Cómo era? I come and I will give you the money. How much, how much do you need the money? I don't know how much money. <laughs> <laughs> I need to Thank make you. money. <laughs> Sorry, teacher. Okay. And could you borrow me your book, your favorite book? Mm, yes, I can. Uh, 
it's my, it's my turn. Voy a hacer una porque la, la, la anterior me la ganaste. <laughs> si sí lo, sí lo puedo hacer o sí, 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 correcto eh, eh, da como más respuestas así que esta, por ejemplo esta mira. can you give me the car? no I take sería sí. Sí o oh no, I'm, I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. Yeah. Okay. You owe oh. me. <laughs> the first no. you? So? In another, in another question? Okay. Could you put that, go to the gym with me? Uh, yes. We could, could you ride the bicycle? Could you? Yes. Yes, of course. Ride bicycle. And can you? Can you study English every day? Mm, I can. I cool. And okay. And okay. you? Okay. Um. Call you go to the park? Yes, I can. When? Can you send me a picture, please? Can you? Can you? <laughs> send me. Ah, send me. I'm sorry. <laughs> <Picture>. <laughs> Okay, we are back. Okay, let's wait a little bit. Vamos a esperar un segundo. So we can continue. Mm Okay, so I think everybody is here. Thank you. Yeah, and very good. Hello. Normal. <laughs> Wait. Okay, so uh, um, I was listening to you. Oh my goodness. I love it because you were practicing uh, many more questions. Así exactamente como les había dicho. Y eso está perfecto que agreguemos más preguntas de lo que creemos. Ok. Porque eso nos va a servir para practice, practice, practice speaking. Ok. Even though you don't write them, aunque no las hayan escrito, pero si practice, 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 that's amazing. Ok. Um, so I'm going to ask you, uh, ask to some of you one question and the answer. Le voy a preguntar a algunos de los grupos, uno de cada grupo, una pregunta y su, las respuestas que obtuvieron. Ok. So let's see, for example, Miss Dilcia Jamilet. Can you tell me one question and the answer that you have, please, Miss? Buenas noches, teacher. Hello, eh, Miss. 
Fíjense que eso les comentaba a los compañeros, que hasta ahora me pude conectar porque estaba un poco mal de salud. Yeah. Entonces, eh, sí los estuve escuchando a ellos y todo, no, no pude participar porque tampoco estoy en la casa. Ok. Pero sí, de, de, a partir de hoy voy a tratar de meterle con todo y ponerme al día. Ok, great, Miss. No problem, no problem, Miss. I'm sorry. So it would be Mr. Jorge Antonio. Tell me, Mr., one question and the answer. And thank you, Miss Ilcia. No problem. One question and the answer, Mr. Um, for example, mm -hmm. the first question is uh -huh. Can you ride a buggy? Uh -huh. And Rebecca says, mm -hmm. no, I can't. Oh, okay. Thank you. Very good. Okay. What okay. about you, Mr. Juan Jose? Tell me one question and the answer that you have. Okay. One question. The first mm -hmm. question. Okay. Could you invite me to eat pupusas? Mm. Good invitation and request, amazing. Uh -huh. And what do you say? <laughs> and the answer uh, was yes. And the Saturday, I will invite you. To <laughs> that's <laughs> wow, that's amazing. Good, thank you. Okay. Excellent. Let's see now, Mr. Francisco Marroquin, tell me one question and the answer. Um, Miss Lady Aska. Okay. Uh, can you uh, give me money? Yes. Okay. <laughs> yes, I was listening to that. Yeah. You listen to that, yes. Give me, the, yes. give me the cuenta, she, he was yes. saying. And I was like, what? Give, give me, me the account. cuenta. Give me, give me the account and I will give you money. Oh, I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> yes. Very good. <laughs> Todos estamos utilizando eso. Todos los escuché, listen, y like, can you give me 20 dólares? Can you give me... Yes. Oh, that's... Cerca de diciembre. <laughs> yeah, it's true fact, true fact. Ya viene diciembre, you need the Es money. que nos pagan hasta el lunes, teacher. <laughs> that's sad, 31, yeah, we need the money. <laughs> estamos arañando ahorita. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Everybody uh, needs money. Yeah, everybody needs money yeah. right now. It's true, but very good. Y sí, de hecho, esa es una de las requests, like, mostly, right? Esa es como, like, una de las requests más utilizadas, basically, aunque parezca el chiste, vea, aunque parezca broma, pero es verdad. Very good. Very good that you practiced that one. Excellent. Let's see now, Miss Kenya, can you tell me one question and the answer? I ask to Esmeralda, could uh -huh. I use your phone? Okay. And she said, no, you call them. Oh, okay. And the other question uh -huh. was, uh, can you borrow me your favorite book? Uh -huh. And she said, yes, I can. Oh, amazing. Great. Thank you. Let's go. Michelle Oviedo, tell me, Miss. Yes. Okay. And the first, uh, can you kill me the car? Uh-huh. The, the answer is, I can't, I'm sorry. Okay. Okay. <laughs> and then? Uh, the second call you answer, the email. Uh-huh. In the answer, uh, bueno, la respuesta es de, uh -huh. yes. Yes. Uh, yes. Yes, you yes, were, maybe. Uh, yes, of course. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you. Let's see now. And... Uh, it would be uh, Abigail Mejia. Tell me, Miss. Okay, I practice with Daniel Stet. Okay, Miss Abigail uh, Bonilla. Okay, tell me, Miss. Okay, he called you that English with me. Uh -huh. Yes, of course. Okay, very good, Miss. Thank you. And. Uh, Mejia, oh, Miss Bonilla se retiro. Okay. Uh, well, anyways, uh, now uh, we are going to continue. I'm going to pass attendance. Voy a pasar asistencia. Please say presente. Abigail Mejia. Present. Thank you. Andrea Amalia. Present, teacher. Thank you. Um, Dania Lisbeth. Present, teacher. Thank you. Dilcia uh, Yamilet, no sé por qué dice Mayo. Dilcia Yamilet. Present teacher. Thank you. 
Esmeralda del Carmen. Present teacher. Thank you. Francisco Ernesto. Present teacher. Thank you. Jorge Antonio. Present teacher. Thank you. Jose Ezequiel. Present teacher. Very good, thank you. Juan Jose. Present teacher. Thank you. Kenya Elizabeth. Present teacher. Thank you. Lady Xiomara. Present teacher. Thank you. Mauricio Antonio. Present teacher. Thank you. Mirna Elizabeth. Present please. Thank you. Sandra Abigail. Oh no, me salté alguien. Wait, wait, wait. Rebecca Guadalupe. Present. Thank you, Miss. Sandra Abigail. Sandra Patricia. Present teacher. Thank you. Stephanie Michelle. Present Miss. Thank you. Okay, great. So as you could see, we were practicing like the questions for requests, right? Estamos haciendo un poco de práctica de preguntas para solicitar algo. Now, let's go back to the manual, okay? Vamos a regresar al manual. And we are going to continue with uh, this, the use of can and could, okay? And I would like the help from, let's see, help me to read Jose Ezequiel, can, the sentences and the questions that you can see over there, please. Thank you, one, two, three. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, uh, I can give you my personal information. Mm -hmm. She can't pay for the washer right now. Mm -hmm. Can I have your credit card number? Mm -hmm. Can you tell me how many items you need? Exactly. Thank you. And could, could you help me please, Miss Kenya, please, with could? Sentences with could, please. Cool. Mm -hmm. You could try with another credit card. Mm -hmm. They couldn't give you my billing address. Mm -hmm. Could you spell your last name? Yeah. Could we check the details on my order? Very good. Thank you, Miss Kenya. Okay, as you can see here, look, here we have questions, right? Again, and here we have the questions for requests and and also possibilities, okay, and also for uh, possibility requests and uh, what was the possibility request and permissions, right? Como pueden ver, sí, lo utilizan, vea, para habilidades o posibilidades en oraciones. Aquí tenemos con el can y el can y también tenemos con el cure. Pero también recuerden que como estamos hablando de, por ejemplo, ordenar, ordenar en línea, de productos, entonces debemos de, nos van a pedir cierta información y ahí es donde utilizamos lo del could y el can't. Recuerden que el can es poco formal y el could very formal, right? Now, let's go with uh, and continue. And as you can see in exercise number five, it says complete the questions with can and could. Then ask your, well, we already did this, so in this case, uh, could you write the questions, please? Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna ask you one more time the questions because I want to write them down now. But I'm gonna do a different students, okay? Como yo sé que hicieron varias preguntas, pues las vamos a ir escribiendo acá. Escriban ustedes, por favor. Different write other answers and give. Write questions also and give answers, I mean, ok. Vamos a escribir otras preguntas y quiero que al mismo tiempo les den respuesta, porque eso es algo que estaba notando. You don't remember the answers that I give you. Y las vamos a repasar, by the way, ok. Porque solo me estaban diciendo, yes, I can, no, I can't. Y recuerden que hay otras posibilidades de respuesta, como. Yes, of course, sure, or maybe here you are, sure. Here you are es cuando estás dando un objeto, vea. Aquí tienes, here you are, or sure. Another answer could be certainly, sure. Another answer can be certainly, sure. Well, eso ya la, ya, ya already mentioned it. Or maybe I will be, yes, I will be happy to. And now in the manual, what I want you to do is to write the four questions and write the four answers. And in this case, you are going to send me a picture on WhatsApp group, okay? Please.
No vamos a hacer las preguntas con nuestros compañeros porque ya hicimos práctica, pero sí quiero que las escriban ahí, please. For questions and the for answers. Ustedes se les van a dar las respuestas, please, there. Let's try it, please. Vamos a intentarlo. Please, please. For this, I'm going to give you four more minutes, okay? Four minutes so you can complete them and send that in WhatsApp, the picture of the creations that you have done. Teacher. Yeah. Do we have to finish the questions and at the same time we had to. Yeah, give the answer. Bite? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay, thank you. You are going to create everything here because I, I, I just could like notice that you didn't remember the type of answers that I already gave you. Quiero que utilicen las respuestas que yo les di. No lo de yes, I can, or, or no, I can't. Remember that there are other options. Acuerden que tenemos otras opciones y esas, esas otras opciones quiero que utilicen right now, okay? Las que le acabo de volver a mostrar. Please, please. I'm gonna give you four more minutes, okay? And so you can do it. One more minute, so you can send this the questions and the answers. Two more minutes, okay, maybe, because it's already one minute. Teacher. Yes. Y una posible respuesta mm -hmm. sería yes, why not? Oh, 
Oh, sure. Yeah, you, ah, that's another thing that I was going to mention. Esa es otra cosa que iba a mencionarles. For example, I, I heard, escuché a Mr. Jorge que le dijo, where, where are we going to the party? I think it was the party. Ajá, ustedes pueden dar como follow up questions. Pueden continuar la conversación, ok? Follow the question. Ok, como dar como una follow, wait, what am I writing? Follow questions, follow up questions, ok? Like where, where, why not? When, eh, like why, what, when, where, ok? Pueden, o sea, para, para preguntar más información, ¿verdad? Ok. Yeah, you can do that, mister. Ok, thank you. No problem. Remember that when you finish writing the questions and the answers, please send me the picture on WhatsApp because I want to check them, okay? Recuerden que si terminan de escribir esas preguntas y sus respuestas, please send them in WhatsApp, okay? Las envían en WhatsApp, okay? Thank you, Mr. Juan Jose. Sure. Está sure. Creo que es nos. Eh, sure, maybe only. Great, Miss Michelle. Thank you. Miss Rebecca. Very good. Thank you. Very good, Mr. Mauricio, too. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> he does with me, sure. Yes, why no? Ah, yeah, la de why no, Mr. Seria. Yeah. Si. Yes. Yeah. yes, why not? Ah, Seria okay. Si. Uh -huh, sorry, why not? sorry, sorry, sorry. No, no problem, Mr. Yeah. Pero ya sabemos, ve ahí. Yeah. Why not? ¿Por qué no? Okay. Yeah, that's good, Ben. Okay, let's see, ¿qué me falta? ¿Quién se me pasó aquí? Could you write a <laughs> Very good, Mrs. Esmeralda, amazing. Could you buy pupusas? <laughs> Ay, delicious pupusas. Could you come to my house on Saturday? Yes, very good, Miss Sandra, thank you. Yes, very good, Miss Dania. Can you eat? Oh, with that lemon. Oh, Peter sweet. Very good, Miss. Thank you. Thank you, Miss Elizabeth. Uh, mm, mm, mm. Surely, oh, that's another one, yes. Thank you, Miss Elizabeth. Uh, who is Joe? <laughs> who is Joe? Joe, Miss. Oh, Mr. Jose Ezequiel, okay. Could you, can you dance me something? Very good, mister, thank you. If you have any questions, let me know, okay? Questions or no questions so far?
Can you make a cup of coffee? Very good, Miss Lady. Thank you. Very good, Miss Abigail, too. Okay, so I think I'm missing like two of you only. Very good, Mr. Jorge, thank you. Yes, no problem. Yes, amazing. Please, now that we have learned, okay, how to answer to request possibilities or permissions, ahora que ya hemos podido escuchar, si no sé si ustedes han notado que yo casi siempre les pido permiso hasta para leer, para que lea, para que escriba, para que cree preguntas. How are you going to answer now? You're going to say, sure, miss. You're going mm -hmm. to say, or you're going to say, yes, miss, I can't, okay? Or maybe you're going to say, no, miss. No me van a decir no, you cannot say no. You have to say yes, okay? Or maybe I'm afraid I can, okay? You can say that too, okay? Um, uh, because that's a way to answer, right? The correctly way to answer, okay? Esa sería la forma correcta para responder. Uh, and also, yes, I can or no, I can't, right? Because sometimes maybe you are enfermos, maybe you are in another place and you can say, Miss, uh, I can't right now. I Maybe you can say as well, I have a problem, okay? And like that, right? Because you have to use the correct answers. Questions? So far, questions, questions? No questions. Very good. Okay, just to finish, okay? Even though we only have like two minutes, but we are going to do this page, okay? How are we going to do this page? As you can see here, we are going to use can, can't, could and couldn't, okay? You are going to help me to give answers to the following questions and the following sentences. Number one, what do you think it is? Can or can't? Can't, could or couldn't? What is the correct answer? I? I can. Couldn't. Ah, it's couldn't. Porque dijo, uh, dice ayer, last night, en la noche de ayer. Number two. Can. can, exactly. Can Noel cook Italian can. food? Yes, he? He can. 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 My sister? El año pasado. Good. 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 But, but it's good? Good. 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 It's good. End, okay. But now good. she? Can. Can exactly. Can. They couldn't. 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 couldn't because uh, go shopping because the store. Uh -huh, yesterday, exactly. Five. Can read when you were four years old. Uh -huh. Cuatro años, ¿verdad? Cuando tenías cuatro años, ¿o sería could or can? Cool. cool. Good, exactly. You read when you were four years old. Yes, I can. Can? Cool. Look at the question. Good, cool. exactly. Yeah. Ellie? Can. Can ride a bike. She rides it to school every day. Seven, I am very tired, so I can. I can't go out tonight. Can't, right? Then eight. Can't. 
Could you see the mula's sign? No, I? No, I could. Oh, I couldn't. couldn't. Exactly. Thank you. Number nine, when, ah, igual, el, en el pasado era? Could. Could. El presente es can, ¿verdad? So, can. could, ajá. Uh -huh. Could I talk to you about the company report? Most dinosaurs walk on land, but some could could, mm -hmm. could, could fly or even, fly, even uh -huh. swim. Uh -huh. 11, excuse me, I can can hear you right now. The music can. is loud. 12, I could could drive a truck when I was uh, only 16 years old. Douglas hit the tree because he can. can stop his car. How many hot dogs? Can. 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 You eat one at a time, and the last one, 15. I can. Can't. I can't read. Can't. Can't. Ah, okay. Let's see. He terminado, and let's see how many answers. Ooh, we have the nine. It's when can I talk to you about the company report? Okay, it was can. And excuse me, I I'm sorry. I'm, let me let me put you on mute so we can listen to me. Okay, so number eleven is excuse me. I can't hear you right now. The music is too loud. No te puedo escuchar ahorita. Dice la música está muy fuerte. Y la number thirteen. Douglas hit the tree because he. Eh, couldn't stop his car. No pudo detener su carro. But very good job because the other ones were perfect. Porque las demás estuvieron muy bien. Thank you for trying. And so now, questions, comments, doubts. Do you have any questions? Do you have any doubts? Nope. No oh, questions. No questions. Clear as a water or clear as a rachata? Or chat <laughs> Okay, so we are going to stay here. Nos vamos a quedar por acá. We are going to continue tomorrow. Okay, thank you everybody for coming to today's class. And now, see you tomorrow. Have a good night, everybody. Bye bye. Thank you. Good night, everyone. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye everybody. Bye. Good night. Bye. Good night. Good night. Take care, everybody.